So about two weeks ago, I created my second AI film, but this time I incorporated talking AI characters within the scenes. Here's a clip from the film. This is your last chance. After this, there is no turning back. You take the blue pill. Oh God, not the blue pill. The story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe. Don't do this to me, Morpheus. You take the red pill. Oh wow, a red one. You stay in Wonderland. Can I show you how? Did you just take both of the pills? Now you might be wondering, how did I manage to generate myself into a shot where I'm having a conversation with Morpheus from the Matrix? Well, Picolabs and Runway ML both now have their own lip sync feature that anybody can use. Here's another cool little project that I just finished. It's an AI UFC fight promo between Elon Musk and Mark Zuckerberg. This isn't just any fight, it's Elon Musk versus Mark Zuckerberg in the metaverse. Uh, you know, this is the kind of stuff you dream about. I've been in the fight game a long time, but this, I mean, this is next level. They're both in it to win it and neither wants to back down. Do I think it's personal? Oh, hell yeah, it's personal. Link is in the description for that video as well if you want to go check that out. Anyway, I wanted to do this video showcasing how I was able to produce these results so that you guys can go and create your own AI film and videos. Now, to start things off, we need a character. So in this instance, I'm going to use this photo of Dana White uh, that I used in that AI film. So let's head on over to Runway ML and you can see here the homepage has changed a little bit. Now there's two ways to do this. I'm gonna showcase both methods so that you can compare the results. All right, so the first method, we wanna scroll down and we wanna click generative audio. Now there's two things we need to do. We need to select what face we're going to use. And then we also need to select the audio source or the voice that we'll be using. Let's click upload and go to that image of Dana. There you go, that's uploading. Now for the voice, you've got four options. You can upload your own audio file. You can record your own audio with your microphone. You can clone a voice, but this option, you actually need to pay for the pro subscription. And the last option is to provide the default voices provided by Runway down here. And then you can write whatever text you want. Now I already have an audio file that I generated in 11 labs, which sounds like Dana White. So I'm just gonna upload that. And here's the uploaded audio file, which goes for about 22 seconds. And you can see down here as well, the faces and image has now been uploaded. Now let's click generate and see the results that we get. So that took about six or seven minutes to generate. Let's click play and let's have a look at the result. This isn't just any fight, it's Elon Musk versus Mark Zuckerberg in the metaverse. Uh, you know, this is the kind of stuff you dream about. Now, if you notice something, yeah, sure, his head's moving, he's talking, he, he's saying like, it's, it's doing a good job of moving his head. However, one thing I didn't like, you can't really see anything moving besides his head, which doesn't really, like when you watch that in an AI film and video, it, it kind of looks pretty crap. Now I'm gonna show you guys the second method, which actually brings the video to life more. Uh, it actually produces a much better result. Let me, let me show you what I mean. Let's now go back and head back to the dashboard. And we wanna scroll down here where it says text image and video, and we wanna click upload a file and we wanna select the image of Dana again. While that's uploading, let's go down here, make sure upscales are selected and we wanna just go here for the motion. We're just gonna do one for now, okay? So what we've done now, we've given Runway the image and we've converted it to a four second video. Let's have a look and I'm gonna show you guys the best result. So this one here, and I'll just enlarge it so you guys can see, it's good, his body's moving, but the hand, I don't like how the hand screwed up there. Let's look at the second one. The second one, uh, if I press play, it's, it's not too bad. It's just not moving as much. Let's have a look at the third one. Hopefully the third one's good enough. Okay, this one's a bit better. It could still be a bit, it, it, look, I'll be honest, I've produced better results before, but what I'm looking for, if you see here just a little bit, his body is moving as well. And that's what we want. His head's obviously moving. And, and I'm gonna show you guys what to do now. Let's save this, okay, and click download. Let's go back to generative audio and we wanna click upload. And I want you guys to now select the video instead of the image. 
And for the audio, I'll use the exact same thing. So I'm gonna click generate and then I'm gonna show you guys the difference in the results. <laughs> Of course I ran out of credits and have to buy more. Please, Runway, if you could sponsor me and just give me a pro plan so I can do as many videos as possible for you guys. All right, so the second video is finished. I'm gonna play both videos now and you should be able to see on the screen, one of the videos you can't really see any movement of the body, but the other one you can see a little bit more movement and it sort of just adds an additional element, just makes the, makes the uh, scene seem a little bit more realistic. So this is why I actually prefer this method instead of the other one. Obviously it would cost a little bit more because you are using the uh, image to video and that would require more credits. But personally, I wouldn't use the first method. I want you guys to literally go and give this a try and let me know the results that you get. If you guys do think of any good AI video or films and you want me to showcase them, jump into my Discord, send them to me, send them to me on Twitter, send them to me on, sorry, not Twitter X, send them to me on Instagram and I will have a look at them and maybe I'll showcase all of my subscribers. I'll showcase all of the videos from them. So uh, guys, that's it for the video. I really appreciate you guys always. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.